Welcome back to my channel, Latin Language, and we're going to discuss Gas Law, Charles Law. Okay, so let's start with the formula. So Charles Law, meron nang tayong nitong volume and temperature. So formula natin ay V1 over T1 is equal to V2 over T2. Yung V1 nating original volume, ang V2 naman that will be the resulting volume. T1 is the original temperature and T2 will be the resulting temperature. Okay, next one. Take note, ang temperature must be in Kelvin for all gas laws. So kung magsasolve kayo, lagi nyo siyang gawing Kelvin. Mapa-Celsius man siya or Fahrenheit, gawin mo siyang Kelvin. So kung naka-Celsius siya, mag add ka lang ng 273.15. Kapag Fahrenheit naman, mag-add ka ng 459.67. Tapos dun mo siya i-multiply sa 5 at yung sagot, divide mo ng 9. So let's start with the first problem. Given mo ay 500 ml of a gas at 18 degrees Celsius, what is its volume at 10 degrees Celsius? Okay, first one, lagi mo lahat yung given. Ang V1 natin dito ay 500 ml kasi yung original. So, hinahanap dito yung V2. Lagay ko na siya sa SX. T1, ito yung temperature, yung original temperature. That will be 18 degrees Celsius. At magiging 10 degrees Celsius now. So, that will be T2. So, color-coded naman siya to guide you. Ngayon, lagay natin yung formula. So, we have V1 over T1 is equal to V2 over T2. And let's substitute the yung sa formula. So we have 500 over 291.15 is equal to X over 283.15. Okay, sir, so then getting in 291.15 at 283.15. Remember, ang given mo ay naka Celsius. Kapag magsasolve ka dito, dapat naka-Kelvin muna. Okay? So, kaya siya naging 291.15 and 283.15. Next, pwede nyo siyang i-cross-multiply para mahanap natin yung value ni x. So, multiply mo yung 500 sa 283.15. At yung sagot niyan, divide mo sa 291.15. And you will get... Uh, the final answer of 486.26. That will be the new volume. The new V2. Okay, let's move to problem number two. A gas occupies 5 liters at standard temperature. What is the volume at 333.0 or 333 degrees Celsius? Okay, so na ba yung standard temperature? Standard temperature that is 0 degrees Celsius or 273.15 Kelvin. So, lagi ka yung given. So, color-coded naman siya. So, yung 333, magdagdag ka ng 273.15 para maging Kelvin. So, that will be 5 over mo ng 273.15. This equal to X over mo ng 606.15. Ngayon, maanap na natin yung value ni x by cross multiply. So that will be 5, multiply mo sa 606.15. Yung sagot niyan, i-divide mo sa 273.15 and you will get an answer of 11.096. So the new volume is 11.096 liters. Moving on, let's go to problem number 3. What change in volume results if 60 ml of gas is cooled from 33 degrees Celsius to 5 degrees Celsius? Take note, ang inaanap dito is change in volume, hindi yung bagong volume. Uh, so we need to find first yung resulting volume. So let's start. Giving given. So ang uh, Celsius going mong Kelvin. Then that will be 33 magiging 306.15. Ang 5 degrees Celsius magiging 278.15 Kelvin. Okay. 
next, lagi may formula. And after that, you have to substitute the values. So that will be 60 over 306.15 is equal to x over 278.15. So to find the value of x, you're just going to cross multiply. 60 multiply mo sa 278.15. Yung sagot niyan, divide mo sa 306.15. So the final answer, ni round up ko na rin siya. That will be 54.51. However, inaanap dito kasi change in volume. So gawin mo lang yung original volume. Kunin mo absolute value nila. 60 minus 54.51. And you will get an answer of 5.49. So 5.49 ml is the change in volume. Ito yung pinakasagot dito sa problem number 3. Okay, let's go to number 4. Calculate the decrease in temperature in Celsius. When 8 liters at 25 degrees Celsius is compressed to 4 liters. So the game being given, okay, color coded naman siya. Inaanap natin dito yung resulting temperature. Muna, napin muna natin yung resulting temperature. But yung pinakadulo, ang um, pinaka final answer dapat natin makita is yung decrease in temperature. Okay, so we'll get to that. Okay, so the game being formula, at uh, e substitute natin yung mga values. So that will be 8 over 298.15 is equal to 4 over x. Okay, so to find the value of x, e cross multiply mo lang. So that will be 8x is equal to 1192.6. And divide both sides by 8, and that will be 149.07. 5 Kelvin. Okay, nahanap na natin resulting temperature. However, we need to find the decrease in temperature in Celsius. So, paano natin gagawin yun, sir? So, gawin mo muna siyang Celsius. Yung 149.075 Kelvin. Buwasa mo ng 273.15 and you will get negative 124.075. So, Celsius na yan. Ngayon, hinapin natin yung absolute value, yung difference, yung layo ng negative 124.075 sa 25 degrees. So, kukunin natin yung absolute value and you will arrive at 149.075 degrees all shoes. Yung layo ng 25 sa number line papunta sa negative 124.075 ay 149.075. So, um, final answer natin dito, 149.075 degrees Celsius is the decrease in temperature. Let's move to number 5. Final problem. When the volume of a gas is changed from blank ml to 852 ml, change from 315 degrees Celsius to 452 degrees Celsius. Ngayon, what is the starting volume? So, same. Lagi mo yung given. And, natin, lagi natin yung formula. And, the next step is substitute the values. So, we have x divide 1 of 588.15 is equal to 852 over 725.15. Ngayon, i-multiply mo na siya. Or, cross-multiply. The x is equal to 852. Multiply mo siya sa 588.15. At yung sagot niyan, divide mo ng 725.15. And you will get an answer of 691.035 ml. And that is the final answer. Ito yung starting volume natin, 691.035 ml. And that's the end of the lesson about Charles Law. 
Yung ibang gas law nasa description box. Can you check the links below? And if you would like to comment or suggest another Mac and Language video, or kung may assignment kayo, or may tanong kayo dun mismo, dito mismo sa video na to, kindly comment down below. And this is James, your Mac and Language instructor. Please like and subscribe, and also click the bell notification para bilit kayo sa bagong videos ng Math and Language. Thank you. Goodbye.